Let's take a look at a different stoichiometry problem. In this problem, if 4.4332 moles of O2 are produced, how many moles of NO2 will also be produced? Uh, so what we want to do is we want to figure out what relationships are going to help us to get from moles of O2 to moles of NO2. Now, we already have the balanced equation it's given to us here. This is our balanced equation. So remember, our balanced equation tells us our mole ratio. This, we're asking about moles and moles. So this problem is only going to require one step because we're going to be able to convert our moles of O2 directly into moles of NO2. So I know I have 4.4332 moles of O2. I want my moles of NO2. I look at the balanced equation, and I'm going to convert. So I'm going to put this over 1. I want moles NO2. I want to get rid of the moles of O2. If I look in the balanced equation, NO2 has 2 for my coefficient. O2, there's nothing here, so that means that there's a 1 there. So remember, if it's blank, you can, it means 1. So I can simply multiply through. So I have 8, 8, 6, 6, 4 moles of NO2. I make sure 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I have 5 significant figures. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 significant figures. So my final answer is 8.8664 moles NO2.